G'day guys, Greg here. Well, it's Fast Food Friday food review time and today I'm off to Hungry Jack's. I got an email today saying they got a brand new burger called the Cordon Bleu Cheeseburger. It looks pretty good in the photo, so let's whip on in and get one, see if it looks like the one in the photo and see if it tastes any good. Let's do it. All right, well, here's the Hungry Jacks I'm going to today. Let's go get one. Oh, yeah. All righty, well, here we go. The Cordon Bleu cheeseburger from Hungry Jacks. Let's suss it out. All righty. Well, there's the size of it. Well, that's what it looks like. Not too bad. Quite attractive. Lots of mustard there. In fact, the website says it's made with a French twist. Hot, tasty ham, cheese sauce, tangy mustard, mayonnaise, onions, and pickles. Right, well, let's see. Well, it's got like lots of mustard and mayonnaise there. There's a few folds of ham. Looks like less than in the picture on the website, doesn't it? I don't know. Well, there's a pickle. There's your cheese. There's your meat. And there's your burger. Well, let's try some of this mustard. Tastes like mustard, except with a bit of mayonnaise mixed in with it. It doesn't look like a bad burger, does it? It looks pretty good. Now it costs three dollars ninety, so you can get a cheesy cheeseburger for two bucks. So you're paying a dollar ninety for a bit of ham, I think. Anyway, that's all right. The ham's not cheap, you know. It's like eighteen bucks a kilo. Although this ham, I think, is about twelve bucks a kilo. Anyway, let's dive on in and see what it tastes like. Mmm, not bad, there's the interior view, not a bad looking burger. Now basically all I got then was this taste of mustard. There's a lot of mustard on this burger, but that's fine. I really like mustard, and what better place to put some mustard than on a burger? For some reason the hams decide, oh no, oh well, I don't know what that was, but the, tell you what, the mouse in my car is going to be morbidly obese soon with the amount of food it's been getting. It's dripping with product, which is always a good thing. So you might need to wear a bib or something if you decide to get one of these. But look at all this sauce. I mean, there's heaps of that beautiful cheesy sauce. Mmm. They do do a good cheese sauce, the old HJs. That's what she said. And this one's nice. Mixed in with that mustard and mayo. Mate, what more do you want? It's on the sesame seed bun, which is beautiful and fresh today. The meat was nice and flame grilled, just like a HJ burger should be. And I'm dying for another bite. Mmm. Mmm. Yummo. This is really nice. The cordon bleh burger. Mmm. Now I just got a little bit of onion on this and I, after getting it I thought gee that onion tastes good. But this burger just seems to be a really light on onion. I think they could have put a whole heap more on this for me because the onion really blends in with these flavours and makes this burger taste really good. It's a quite a tasty burger. I'm really liking it because it's got heaps of sauce. You can taste the ham. You can taste that mustard, that's for sure. There's so much of it. Is there too much of it though? Hmm, quite possibly, but I don't mind. Don't mind a little bit too much mustard on things. If you went to Ikea and saw how much I put on a hot dog, hey, <laughs> you'd see how much I love my mustard. And this mustard's not too bad. This whole burger's pretty good, but for around four bucks, you know, it's not cheap. But would I come and get another one of these again? Well, I don't know, I'd probably just stick to the cheesy cheeseburger. I get two of them, 
for the price of one of these. Although the ham on this does taste pretty good. But I think I've had enough of it now to know a score I'm gonna give it. Out of ten. Well, price-wise, four bucks. Like I said, you can get two cheesy cheeseburgers for that. Taste-wise, well, it tastes pretty nice. I can taste the ham on there. I can taste the beef. I can certainly taste the mustard. I can taste that cheese sauce. Could have done with a few more onions. The pickles, I think it might have only had one on there. I would have loved two. But anyway, for an all-over value, all-over flavour, all-over taste, all-over everything score for this Gordon Blech! burger from Hungry Jack's, I'm giving it a... 5.9 out of 10. It actually tastes pretty good and I'm really enjoying it. The price of it's probably a little bit too much, but all over it's a pretty good burger. I probably should have scored it a six and a half. In fact, you know what? I think I will. Anyway, there's the Cordon Bleu burger from Hungry Jack's. What do you reckon? Are you going to go in and get one? If you go and get one, tell them Greg sent you. And if you do get one and you don't like it, well, don't blame me. So would I come on in and get another one of these burgers? Well, yeah, I would. I'd come on into Hungry Jack's, I'd walk up to the counter, and then I'd order two cheesy cheeseburgers instead. Much better value. Anyway, I'm going to sit here and finish this off. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I'll review something. See you then. Oh, yeah.